Hi friends. So the time after Christmas is the best time of year for any cheap person to go shopping because the deals are just too good. And as we know, I'm one of the world's cheapest people. So this was like my Christmas. So I'm going to show you what I got. It's a little collective haul and it's part one because I ordered some more stuff, but it's not ready yet. And it's all bras and underwear, so I'd rather have that in one concrete pervert video and have this as like the fun stuff. So if you want to see bras and underwear, that will be here hopefully by next week. But I will show you what I got this time. So the first two items are from Torrid, and they had a really good after Christmas sale. It was 50% off clearance, and that's what I usually wait for anyways. I never get anything brand new from Torrid. I'm always like a season behind, but I'm okay with that. And this one you might recognize from an inside the dressing room and I talked about it and then I was like, it was like $88 full price and I was like, I will wait for you. And I did. And guys, this was $17. So I'm so happy I waited and I'm so happy they had my size um, when the time came. So it is this black lace dress. There's an inner layer that goes probably right around the knee and then this long flowing lace and it's like a big spinny like it's perfect it moves so well it doesn't like weirdly cling to you it is it's a statement dress and I love that um and I did get a different um torrid black lace dress recently but this one I feel like has better movement and it has um a more flowy arm it has an arm very similar to this like it's not a cap sleeve or anything so I do have two black tour dresses that I am in the process of decluttering, so I'm going to see if my mom wants that other dress, and if not, I'll probably Poshmark it, um, because this was the preferred dress, and it finally went on sale. The only thing I'm not, like, really digging is that the sleeves have these long ties with, not beads, but little heavier things at the end, and they do kind of clack um, and stuff, and they are just kind of long, so I might just, like, cut these up or tie them really tight right here so they don't constantly bounce on me but other than that I really really love the cut of this dress I got it in a size 1x and it does have a really stretchy waistband so if you are kind of in between sizes and the one is the only one left if you're a two you'll definitely fit in this and it does have the flowy arm so you're not going to be constricted in this nice crisscross top great for your boobs and then just that flowy lace I love this and the inside layer I'm always nervous about the inside layer riding up and then you just have like lace over your butt the inside layer on this is long enough that I feel like it's not going to budge, so I really like that. But I waited for this, and I got it for a really cheap price, so my cheap heart is very happy, and I'm so happy I have this because it's very Stevie Nicks witchy, which I'm all about. And I'm seeing her in March! Okay, another thing I've had my eye on since this came out in, like, September, it's this velvety moto jacket. So this one also retailed $98.90 never gonna happen in my book but you know it went on sale this came down to I think 33 and then I had the $10 birthday coupon so this then became 23 so it's like you're stealing at this point and this one is so nice like a deep velvety red um it's not a plush velvet in person which I like I feel like that would look like a velour tracksuit this is just a crushed velvet so really really nice look how awesome that's coming up on the camera so nice deep rich red the um little snap across the top i love a jacket like that zips this i got in a size two it was the only one left but i usually can go like size up in a jacket i'm i'm very much an across the board one at torrid which i like i know my size there but a two in a jacket never a bad idea and this zips and it fits very comfortably it's not tight when you like you have full dexterity in this jacket so I really like that it's lined with a really really warm kind of fabric um and I just really like this it has zipped pockets it has some stitching up this side and up the arms as an added detail so this just looks really really elevated I love jackets so I knew I wanted this and that I would wear it a lot so I'm really happy I have this one okay so the next two things are shoes. Um, my mom and I went to Lord & Taylor and they always have really good sales. Like I know things seem really expensive there, but they always have a crazy sale going on. Then when you use your Lord & Taylor card, you get like an additional um, money off. And then my mom and I are the same size shoe. So we're like, now we can just share these. So it's like going across two people. So we saw these and they looked kind of fun. And we're like, let's just try them on. So they are Betsy Johnson booties. They're like this weird material it feels like 
a wetsuit or like a really thick bathing suit. So they're like really stretchy. So they're really different. So we wanted to try them on. Um, and they have a little kitten heel. I usually do like a wedge or even just like a regular heel. So I've never done like a little kitten heel. And they're kind of narrow and I have really wide feet and so does my mom. We put these on, it's stretched with our feet without looking like comical. These are so comfy. We were, we were both like, we each had one on one foot. We're like, this feels like a slipper. Um, it has the zip on the inside. So we were like, let's get them. And then they ended up being so cheap. So it worked out really well and it's a fun cheetah. I've seen um, like cheetah booties on like Eloqui and stuff and I wanted to try them. And then it happened, and I, I like the little red detail. Someone's like, oh, paint the bottom red. I'm like, that's for Louboutins. Like, I'm not going to be some kind of imposter. Like, I'll have the little red detail. I don't need to be, like, people think I'm faking Louboutins. Like, no, I, I'm cheap, but I'm not that cheap. So these are going to be such a fun pop. Me and my mom were, like, trying to think of all the outfits we can do with these. So I'm really excited that these are going to be a fun statement piece. And again, we saved... A ton of money on these I don't remember the price but I do remember us like cheering at the uh, checkout so really really happy about these okay the next thing is essentially like a birthday Christmas present for myself oh I really enunciated that tea um, so my current Ugg slippers which I wear all the time I'm not really into the Ugg boots anymore um, I still have mine from high school but the Ugg slippers I wear all the time I wear them to the gym I wear them to spin class because then you get your spin shoes so it's easy to have a slip on slip off these are so worn down like there should be fur here but that is so worn down I've had these since 2008 like it was time they're like a hundred dollars but you're gonna have them for 10 years um and then we had the Lord and Taylor discount as well so I did get brand new Ugg slippers and again, I know I'm going to like them. I know I'm going to wear them for probably 10 years. So it's nice to have, look how like gross this one is and how nice and fluffy this one is. Like it was nice to have an upgrade finally. Um, so I am cheap, but I don't mind spending a hundred dollars if it's going to be something I know I'm going to wear and have for a very long time. And I have all my Ugg products still for over the past like 10 years. So I knew I was going to wear these a lot. I'm going to take a lot better care of them than, you know, the ones I had from high school. But it's going to be really nice to have like a full fur slipper instead of that really worn down one. So we upgraded the Ugg. Okay, and finally, just a few makeup items. I get Tarte emails. I don't know why, but I am on the email list. And my sister uses the Shape Tape, and it works really, really well on her. And I don't know if it's like me getting older, the stress of life, all of it, but I noticed like I get really like crinkly and gross under here. My makeup doesn't sit well, so I was like, I want to try Shape Tape. And they were having a really good sale, but the Shape Tape was still like 29 bucks. So I was like, not gonna happen but the shape tape foundation was heavily discounted i was like let me try it see if i like um you know the formula because i've had other tart items that i didn't really care for um so i got the tart shape tape matte foundation and i got this in fair light neutral and i still feel like this might i'm wearing it today but i also caked on other makeup on top of it it's a little too yellowy for me so I think I'm gonna hold off on using this till the spring and summer when I have some sort of pigmentation in my skin right now I'm transparent so I should have probably went for a lighter um but I'm gonna make this work and just wait till I tan um <laughs> and just wait for the spring and summer and wear this but I do like um the coverage and um all that stuff so that I think came to like $18 like it was pretty cheap and my foundation right now is like 11 so I was like my drugstore foundation so I was like the $7 difference just to try it out because I know shape tape works really well I was like oh, I'll make I'll try it um and then the Sephora birthday gift for the past two years has been Tarte um blush and I timed it out perfectly I literally ran out on my birthday and then the Sephora birthday gift is not a Tarte blush anymore um, so I found this, it's a set, it's a blush and a mascara, the full size blush for seven bucks for both of these. So I was like, why not get a blush and a mascara for essentially three fifty dollars each? Why wouldn't you do that? Especially when I know I like the Tarte blush. So now I have this blush, this is in first class, a blush I know I'm going to like, and then like 
a bonus mascara. I could just put this like little one in my purse. Um, actually, little ones are like the perfect size to get because mascara dries out. Just get the little one. So, and for $3.50 each, that's better than a drugstore price. So, whole shebang at Tarte was $25. Bucks, and I used Ebates, so I got money back. And I think they were having free shipping. So, like literally said and done, $25. Bucks. So, I think that's a pretty good win. I extreme couponed at Lane Bryant, so you will see that next week, and I'm so excited about the deals I got there too. So that is my little collective haul, shoes, makeup, torrid stuff, you know. I don't really do shoes and makeup a lot, so I figured I'd show you. I'm just cheap and I like showing you deals. So that is what I have this time. There will be a part two. It's gonna be a bunch of bras and underwear. Um, so do with that what you will. Um, so thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.